So we're starting to vlog in the kitchen today. This is actually, or was supposed to be my off day. And then I realized the things that I do on my off day are the things that you guys wanna see. First of all, I'm fine. My mouth is blue because I made myself some herbal tea. As I was starting my day off, I realized people wanna see me do the dishes. People wanna see me run errands. People wanna see me clean. And most importantly, People want to see what I eat in a day. What better day to show you than a day I'm supposed to go food shopping. So right now I'm cleaning the dishes. I haven't made myself breakfast yet. I slept in because it's my off day. So it's like noon. <laughs> so as soon as I'm done scrubbing these dishes, I'm gonna let them sit in soap and water for a little bit. But as soon as I'm done with that, I'm gonna make myself some breakfast at noon. So the first thing I love to eat to start my day, no matter what time it is, no matter what time I wake up, is a bagel. These are gluten-free bagels that I eat. Um, they kind of taste like a pretzel. I really, really like them. I like to add a little sweetness to like the cream cheese is I like to add some pomegranate seeds to the top. And I feel like it adds some nutrition to this whole breakfast. Cause I don't know, cheese and bread I feel like isn't enough. I like to add some vitamins. Mm. That is so delicious. I'm gonna take Bear on his afternoon walk and we're gonna work out. So we're at the food store. I got myself a little coffee and I think I'm gonna build myself a salad when I'm here to bring home for lunch so I don't have to like wait to make my food when I get home because I'm really, really hungry. Um, and then yeah, I'm gonna show you what I'm getting. This looks so good. We're back in the car and Bath and Body Works is next to Giant. So I stopped and got a little bit of goodies for Valentine's Day. I'll do like a little haul when we get home. After I make my salad, I'm gonna do a little haul for you guys. I'm gonna light my new candle because it looks like it smells amazing. I'm snacking on my salt and vinegar chips while I make the salad. So I actually got some of these peppers with like stuffed cheese and meat in them. So I'm just gonna put two of those in here. And I'm just gonna sprinkle all these all over. Look how delicious. Some pineapple salsa, my Olive Garden Ranch. I do this over the sink in case it gets messy, but I like to like mix my salad so it's everywhere. The dressing gotta share the love, so. Then I take a pickled egg. For lunch, I'm having this salad. And I know it looks weird with like chips off to the side, but I love, love, love eating chips. So let's dig in. Mmm. Mmm. Put this on a chip. I was at Bath and Body. I got myself some vanilla buttercream hand cream. I got this Feel and Loved antibacterial hand spray, which is vanilla cloud scented. And then I got a positively sweet candle for Valentine's Day. I'm gonna put this in the closet, but this is dark chocolate truffle scented. Are you okay? It's okay. I'm so sorry. Are you upset at mama? Are you? 
I waste no time and I'm getting my things together in here because I am dropping off an order at designer consigner today for those of you who don't know I'm in a small town called Bethlehem Pennsylvania and my clothing is sold in a storefront called designer consigner I have like my own section of the store I'm dropping off some perfumes as well as clothes um, my fragrance is available online if you guys are interested this is her So if you go over here, this is where Crave Bethlehem is down there. That's where I get my teas. So now Designer Consigner is right next to the tea shop that I go to every day. Crave is actually under renovations right now, so I haven't gone there in like a week. But anyways, it's this cute little courtyard in Bethlehem that connects to the main street where Designer Consigner used to be. Um, so you come down here and there's like the joint, there's a coffee shop right here. And then you get over here and this is the new shop. Alright, I gotta drop some things off. <laughs> So this is my favorite item that's here right now. I remember it was like 2019, summer 2019, um, Chanel put out like their boat collection and I've had my eye on this bag for so long. I think I might just get it this summer if it's still in the shop. So this is my Burberry jacket. If you guys remember, I got this for like a fall haul in a vlog like a while ago. I wore it once or twice. And as much as I love it and it's just so beautiful, it just was one of those coats I guess I never really ran to. So it's for sale in Designer Consigner if you guys are interested. My third favorite bag is this bronze Louis Vuitton Year 2K bag. cucumber and then I have some crab legs. I always leave room for a midnight snack. So this isn't my last meal of the day. This is actually, this is my third meal of the day. I always do another meal like before I go to bed. Like I lay in my bed and then I get hungry and then I eat a final meal before I actually fall asleep. I use the other dish for the shells. Don't make fun of how I crack open crab legs. I don't even know what I'm doing. I just like I don't know, as I go along, I just break it open. My gosh, such a big piece. Crab legs are my favorite food in the world. Mmm. When I was little, this was my favorite food. Oh my, look at that. So the other half of the crab legs is going to Colin when he gets home from work. I am not a clean crab leg eater. I know it's technically not healthy to have a midnight snack, but it's either I snack throughout the day and have my meals and then I'm fine when I go to bed. But when I just have three meals during the day, I'm like, I need a fourth meal. And today was one of those days where I didn't snack. I like to bring a bag of nuts with me into the car, like pistachios so that I can eat while I drive if I'm hungry. If Crave wasn't under renovations today, I definitely would have gotten a protein shake. Oh. 
I got the whole chunk. <gasps> oh. <gasps> Guys. <gasps> oh my God, it's gonna fall. Okay, I just put it, it all fell into the dip. Okay, good. Oh, this is delicious. I'm really, really good at opening crab legs. Mm. So after a meal like that, I wash my hands, brush my teeth, and I get ready for dessert. Dessert today is Chobani Zero Sugar Vanilla Yogurt and these Nestle Dark Chocolate Chips, so. So good. So for my late night snack, I usually eat these nachos. And then I got these gluten-free chicken empanadas that I put in the oven. I love a lot of salsa around them. So good. Hi, booze. So I forgot to film an outro for this vlog and I'm at New York Fashion Week and I'm eating rice. I'm gonna end the vlog here. And it's Valentine's Day, so Happy Valentine's Day, and I love you guys so much, and I'll see you in my next fancy vlog. My next fancy vlog is gonna be all about Fashion Week, and I'm super excited for you to see it. Bye!